What's up guys? <laughs> no. What's up guys? My name is Ryan Snod and in today's video we're talking about why I feel Soundstripe is the best music licensing site for you. Whether you're a freelancer, small time business owner, or a creative, I think this is the best music licensing site out there and we're going to talk about it and compare it to some of the other ones out there today. Make sure to stick around to the end of the video because I will be sharing a 10% off coupon code that you can use. So with that in mind, let's jump into it. It has been a hot minute and the reason for my absence here on YouTube is because I have been booked up with freelance projects. But while doing this freelance creative work, I've come across one of the best music licensing sites and I cannot wait to share it with you guys. Just full disclosure, this video is not endorsed by this company. They didn't reach out to me or anything. This is my candid experience with a music licensing site. Which site is it you might ask? It's Soundstripe. So I keep running into the same issues with a lot of my clients that I'm working with. They want to make sure that their video is completely legal. They're not breaking any laws when it comes to copyright infringement or anything like that. So I went to the trusty internet to try and find a good solution for this. And I think I found a really, really good option. I compared a lot of different sites from like premiumbeat.com to um, like Musicbed or some of these other different options out there. Um, but I think that I found a really good option that I wanted to share with you guys my experience with that. So the main thing that attracted me to Soundstripe right off the bat was the price. It's only $135 a year, so that's right around 11 bucks a month, so just about a Netflix subscription. Somebody that's just starting out with music licensing, um, when you can spend $50, $100, $200 a song. So uh, that's the other huge benefit with Soundstripe, is it's unlimited downloads. So you can download every single song from their library and keep it after this year, and then just scrap your subscription and then just be done with it. So um, I'm not going to do that though, that's just a lot of music to download, but uh, it is an option you can do, so there is 100% unlimited downloads, which is super, super helpful. Um, the other thing that I really, really like about this service is that you can see the waveform. So, if you're looking through the, when you're browsing through music, um, you can see the waveform to see if it's like a building song, if it's like slower or more kind of dramatic, or if it's just very normal and kind of even the whole time you can see that on the waveform which saves me a ton of time in post when I'm looking for a really good song. The other huge benefit that I love about this is that their staff put together a lot of staff pick playlists as well as theme playlists. So when I'm editing like a wedding there is I do playlists and there is wedding reception playlists already curated for me. So when compared to some of these other sites though I really don't like the whole pay per song. I get the idea for that but it's usually like 50, 100, 200 dollars per song. And I just can't afford that with the budgets that I'm working with. When I'm working in music licensing, a lot of people think it's an afterthought and they don't even think twice about that. So um, it, you can really make your money back really quickly even if you just charge for music licensing for like one project, like 50 bucks or $100. I mean, you just made your entire year's worth back and then some. So uh, it's super price sensitive. Uh, I love the playlist and options. I love that you can watch the waveform and I love how the music just really quick. The other really cool thing is if you don't have a membership, you can just download the songs and put them in. They do have a watermark, but you can just download the songs, pop them into your project and see if they fit and then have no problems if it doesn't because you don't have to pay for it. If you want to poke around the site and look at some of the playlists that are offered, I will link some of those up down in the description below. Um, I'll link up some of the wedding playlists that I've looked at and then I'll also link up some of my favorite stuff. So my favorite playlist that, cur <coughs> so my favorite playlist that they have on there is the Stranger Things themed playlist. It's all like 80s themed synthesizer music, so I love that. So I've used that in vlogs and some other different stuff as well, so I'll make sure I link that all up in the description below. Also, like I promised, I will give you guys a 10% off discount code to save you roughly 10 to $15 if you do sign up for a membership. So that'll be the first link in the description box below. Question of the day, which music licensing sites do you guys use? What other free options are out there for people that don't have budget for music licensing yet, like I was a couple months ago? Uh, as well as some of your favorite options out there for like the best quality of music. Because I would say Soundstripe uh, is, is newer on the scene, they don't have as many users, they don't have a super super high quality of music. If you're looking for a lot of things with like good lyrics and those types of things, you're not really going to find that on Soundstripe. It's more instrumentals and just kind of background music, which is what I really want to use for my videos because I use a lot of voiceover and other things like that to kind of tell stories rather than just having a really badass song. So in review, it's affordable, they've got really good playlists, they got a good waveform, maybe not the best quality of music when it comes to the entire span of the internet, 
Um, but it's definitely one of the best options that I found out there. Somebody like me that's a freelance part-time creator, this is definitely an affordable, great option for people that will cover you legally so people won't come back and sue you in like five or 10 years when you're making the big bucks. That's about it for me guys. Make sure to like and subscribe. I will be posting more content, I promise. I'm working through a lot of my projects now, but I have some more videos coming up in the future to help you grow your brand, your business, and your skills online with video. Just make sure to like this video and share it with one of your friends. I will see you in the next video. Peace.